Not that way, that's the one way, the other way. Oh, 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 back to TGTV and more specifically welcome back to my front room. I'm going to start the video today with some very exciting news and actually let me just touch on what the video is going to be. Today's video is going to be involving me, um, as you may well have already seen, nearly bidding an Aventador S Roadster, my SV and the new Ferrari 488 Pista. So it's a good video but first I've got some very exciting news with my partner Vincero. You will have seen Vincero many many times on my channel before. There's an extreme, that is good Tim, well done mate. Uh, there's a sale on right now, a Black Friday sale is on for a very limited time. I will leave the link below. But as you know, I've built up a collection of uh, Vincero's. I'm wearing the new Rogue on my wrist here. You will have seen this on my Instagram very, or shall I say, very, very recently. Um, so yeah, there's an exclusive discount on for a limited time only. I believe it applies to their whole range. Uh, there was one Black side. One Black Friday sale. A while ago, which I pushed out to you guys and girls, and you all smashed it. So get involved anyway. I'll leave the links below. Go and take a look. Uh, but there are some new models in the collection, as you've seen on my Instagram already, as I've already touched on. So don't, go and get the pot. Anyway, without further ado, should we get on with the uh, Aventador S Roadster shenanigans? No, that's a nod. Okay, let's go. Welcome back to TGTV and more specifically, welcome back to, as you can see behind me, Ferrari. I am at Ferrari today uh, in uh, Kensington, HO and Ferrari, and I've got a guest on the channel, ladies and gents, a guest by the name of Hugh. So Hugh is the owner of this rather nice Aventador S Roadster. You will have seen this car on my channels, uh, Instagram, Snapchat, and all the rest of it many, many times. And I also have come out today in the SV. We thought we'd go for a little drive, but we also got told whilst we were hooning around that there is the first customer pista inside the dealership. So we're gonna go and have a little look at it, have a little look around, and then I'm also gonna discuss whether or not I need a Roadster Aventador, because that, not that bus, that looks rather cool. And with the sun out on a winter's day, it is sick. So I'm gonna cross the road now, try not to be killed. I'll do my best here. London's just chaos at all times. That is mayhem. That is a very, very good dog. Are we gonna get a zoom in on this? It's a really good one. Really, really good. Okay, dogs aside, let's go over the road. Oh, it just looks so good, doesn't it? There's something about the event with the roof off. It's just chaos. It's mayhem. So, so good. It's making me think maybe I should chop my SV in for a roadster. But coming into winter, not really sure if that's the best idea. Anyway, the SV's not been on the channel for a while, so we're gonna have a little look at it. It is alive and well, ladies and gents. I have not got rid of it. I haven't really done any miles on it at all, to be honest. I've probably done 100 miles on it in the past month, if even that. Not even that. But at the moment, we're kind of trolling Ferrari, really, because this is a huge dealership, and we've just dumped these outside. There is a rather nice GT GTC4 Lusso as well outside and as you all know I'm a massive fan of these cars I drove to Le Mans in one a couple of years back with my Ferrari dealer which is not actually this one it is Ferrari Colchester big love to them of course uh, the guys that I've ordered my 812 through but anyway this is HR Owens demo here in London and this is often seen cruising around and it's very very nice spec as you can see in there wafting spec but anyway we're gonna go in then I'm gonna have a little look around and hopefully Hugh's gonna buy a car actually He's been uh, talking to that salesman for quite some time, so I'm hoping he's bought something. I can't see a card machine yet, but fingers crossed. So unfortunately, I wasn't really allowed to film in the showroom. I know, I know. Uh, Ferrari are one of those brands that kind of 
they're a little bit controlling about what goes on social media and all the rest of it and I totally understand that so I wasn't going to barge around with the camera in there shouting the odds you know there's customers about um, and here's a customer car uh, and ultimately the people are working there it's kind of like yeah so we we did not film Hugh is on the channel ladies and gents have you been on the channel before? I have been in the background have you ever said anything have you had a speaking part yet? no, no, no this is your first speaking part I actually got cut that can happen yeah. were you unpleasant? I don't remember yeah, uh, you probably you quite well could have been. Uh, have you bought a car? Uh, I tried. I tried to buy the yellow one. You tried to buy the car? The yellow one. The yellow one. Um, I believe that's a 458 Speciale. So actually, we weren't allowed to film in there, but I'm just filming through the window, so it's kind of the same same thing. So um, you were interested in that. So you have the Aventador S at the moment. I do. Are you enjoying it? Very much. Excellent car. It's a great car, isn't it? Fantastic car. You've got one similar. Yeah, we've, we've got very, very similar cars. Um, but that has tickled your fancy, has it not? Yeah, I can't have a red one, apparently. I have asked, but the red one's apparently in demand. Can't really? Yeah, apparently hard to get. Nah, yellow's better. Or blue. Or maybe a grey. Not grey. a white, though. Grey, yeah. Black grey. Yeah. And obviously, there's a first customer. 488 Pista in there. Um, it's not yours, though, is it? No, it's not mine. It's not mine. So basically, this spec... Because it's such an early car, I think the customer had to go for a very, very basic spec. So this is basically what would happen if you went on the configurator and just accepted whatever came up as the default. It is a very, very light spec, but that's not to say it's not extremely cool and there is carbon all over it. It doesn't look like it's been skimped on, but it's just the spec that everyone's used to. It's very cool anyway, so congrats whoever's car that is. Well done. You're a better Ferrari customer than me. I'm not even allowed to film in the dealership, let alone uh, buy a pista, so yeah, top stuff. Anyway, should we go out on the Ventura S? Yeah, yeah. I don't even know what this video is out at this point, I'm just kind of just making stuff up at this point. Look at the key. Well, don't, please, come on. Look at it, it's just, they just couldn't be bothered, could they? No. That is a Friday afternoon job. No. And that's an, basically an Audi A6 key, is it not? Let's show me the buttons. Oh, Where is it? Don't, please. Well, I got one as well. But there's no, there's no like boot unlock even on it. It's, so it's just a blank button in the middle. So it's chaos. <laughs> they just couldn't be bothered, could they? They're like, right, 4.30, Your, Friday afternoon. Yeah, 300 something thousand. Yours and all. Yeah, fine. Yeah. Okay then, is that safe there? Just to leave outside Ferrari? Yeah, yours is. Oh, I think you do some driving first and foremost. You and we're drive, gonna... I'll, I'll film. Am I insured? You are. Really? You are. It's good yeah. enough for me, come on then. <laughs> well, this is quite cool, didn't expect to drive it. Oh. oh, the seats are so much more comfy. Yeah, comfort. They got massage as well. Have they? Yeah, no, they don't. So these are the non-bucket seats. They're in my SV, and there that's the magic. That's the reason for Roadster. That's the magic window. So you often, you were telling me, you often drive with the roof on, but that little thing open, and you can hear the engine through so there. So that, you go. You don't uh... Hold on. Let's get that down. Have you got the, oh, you've got the Sensone um, speakers as well? Yeah, the 3,000 pound, terrible oh, that's sounding. chaos. It's quite cool in here. I think it is missing the carbon, but you can just take that out and get that carbon dipped if you really cared that much. Yeah, but that doesn't, that's why I didn't do it. I like this, I chose this because it's supposed to look like a fighter plane. And you don't okay. have carbon in a fighter plane, do you? Do you not? I've never been no, in one. And it would all be black, it looks terrible. That is true. You've also got this. And you <laughs> know crisp. from your S that yeah. actually only this section comes in carbon, that's just black. And then you have to buy these, and these are all fake, carbon. None of it's actually real, just this section. And okay. you don't get, and this bit, you're complaining about. You can't get this in carbon from that's, Lambo. No, you have to get that aftermarket, so. It's a bit, bit halfway there. It, it is, it is, but it does quite suit this kind of the spec of the outside. Yeah, black Cause it's like gentleman spec, yeah. even though you're on so <laughs> crisps. Um, what's this? That is part of the travel pack. Travel pack. It's, uh, it's uh, I think it's about 800 pounds. And it <laughs> 800 quid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can it I snap it? What's yeah, the vibe? And uh, it's what you sort your here? phone into. I think I've got one of them. That's, yeah. <laughs> and right. then uh, I have a very rare one of one option, which is... Uh, I don't have one of them. So this is a... Uh, so basically... Is you, that 800 quid as well? Yeah, this is 750 pounds. Right. So, you, when I purchased the car, I can only see a coupe because there were no roadsters. Spin stars. around. Oh, here we go. Yep, go on then. And uh, basically, they said to me, you get one of these, right. and in the coupe, you can either slot it there or here. And right. there isn't one of those here. So I said, I've got, a, I'll usually have two people, so can I have two of these? So I paid extra to have a second one of these. But I challenge you to find the location that Lamborghini put the second cup holder on a roadster. 
So, does I, anyone know? Yeah. It's Would you know? Where the second location is? Where's, where's the other cup holder go? Have a look behind your head, mate. Where? You're Move kidding me. Move this seat forward. I can't, my Film back hurts too much. Over the other shoulder. I can't, I can't even do this. How are you, behind there? there? Behind your head? Yeah. Ow, my spine. <laughs> That is plastic chaos. So that I can have a drink, but it will yeah, just be like coffee just, going down your back. just spilling on my yeah. neck. I so, can't even so, I can see it. It's in there. That is chaos. That's yeah. utter rubbish. Absolute rubbish. What's this making a noise here? Is it uh, very offensive? Yeah. F types are offensive. Yeah. Right. Should we? Should yeah. we go? Can grab one of these. Should I do the honors? Yep. Uh, Oh, and obviously, yeah. Actually, I think sport's noisier, isn't it? It is noisier. There we go. Uh, let's get that off. Can we get rid of it? Certainly can. There we go. Okay, we're off. Okay, right. Are you nervous? Well, you shouldn't be actually. No, I'm not. I've, I've had I'm two actually of them. I'm not nervous in slightest. I'm, I'm not a nervous passenger. It's fine. What's not the worst going to happen? Three hundred and ten grand's worth of. Did you say 310? I, I'm being generous. Did you just say 310? Oh, this is fine with the roof off. Can you can you not say 310? Can we, can we stick to the... Oh, what, sorry, what is it? Uh, can we stick 330? More, um, yeah, a little bit more, but yeah, okay, it's fine. For, 340? Yeah, yeah, that was, yeah. It's still around there, I think. It's pretty much the same, same, yeah. I it just well, feels so much more civilised in the It's SV. a lot more civilised. Are you, are you actually in automatic mode? Oh yeah, I put it in sport. Yeah. Oh yeah, I put it in sport. Yeah, I don't even know what gear you're in, or what you're doing. It sounds a bit like quieter, maybe. Um, it is so much more civilised than the SV. Yeah. I forgot that this was actually borderline usable. The borderline. SV isn't. Borderline usable. Actually, I only ever drive my SV in Corsa, so I'm going to put it in Corsa just to be completely kind of transparent. I feel a bit different. Oh, I think... It probably sounds... It's louder, just in a different it's, way. It's deeper, yeah. It doesn't have those kind of... Yeah, it, yours crackles a bit, mine pops. Is that I thing? hear I you know. about a mile away from my house most yeah. days in this. Yeah. It wasn't chaos. Um, Tom is my near neighbour. Yeah, we are. Uh, I live between Archie and Tom. I and I hear them both crossing. Yeah. yeah. I, I'm in a tower, a different type of tower. So this has got four wheel steer then, and the SV doesn't. Yep, There's, um, do the window. What's that? Do the window, it's there. Where is it? This one here. Middle button. And that's well, yeah, what that's makes the difference. That's a quick window. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's only a little. It's probably just pretty much fallen out. It's probably in yeah. there somewhere. Yeah, we'll, Where are we going we'll anyway? Go what are we doing? Um, you're driving, mate. Do I need an SV Roadster then? Is this what I need for the winter? Uh, an is SV this even Roadster. a real question? You've got heated seats, so you can. Yours is actually on. Oh, you I do like the refinement. You can, you can get the, the heated seat. I don't know how to work it. There we go. Is that. Yeah, yeah no, it's fine, mate. You're, you're a YouTube pro. Yeah. Yeah. There Good you training, go. mate. Set up your own channel. Off you go. Yeah. Have you got one? Everyone's got one. I'm, I'm thinking YouTube. <laughs> YouTube is <laughs> chaos. That sounds like potentially something slightly... Yeah, it could be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably. Not a bad idea. Tell me where we're going, by the way. I don't know where we're going. Um, oh. Oh, oh, oh. So the SV doesn't do that. That's chaos. I don't know what that is. That's... Hello! Yeah. You're, I think you're going the wrong way for a Lamborghini, if I'm honest. Lamborghini should probably go the other way. Oh, where am I going? We were probably going to the wrong area. Oh, okay. Uh, maybe take a right and then right again. Well, I don't know. Oh, I just yeah. do the driving, not the yeah. navigation. It, just, it feels so much more nimble though, and like just the four-wheel steer is something more of a pleasant car to drive. And I, I can talk. That's the difference. When I'm in yours and I try and speak, it's like uh, uh, your uh, guts hurt. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's actually quite comfortable. I do like hearing all the kind of mechanical uh, going on behind that. Yeah, let's go find some width restrictions. I feel like such a show off. It's great. I, I couldn't see it in my lights from there. I feel this is slightly more restricted. You can't really, because the SV's got a little window there. This doesn't. Oh, yeah. And that little window just kind of gives you enough insight to see whether there's like a bus there. <laughs> what is that? That's, yeah. That's really that. Yeah, this is much more chaotic. Oh no, no cyclists. Yeah, don't hit those. Do you know what you're saying? Yeah. You 
got a little bit of uh, A4. Who'd you actually swap? Because they're probably worth. Yours well, actually, no. I think, well, yours is probably worth about the same as mine until the SVJ comes out. And then it could go either way. Because the SV Coupes are 330 to uh, 350, 360 at can the you, moment. Can you replace my face with one of those black hoods <laughs> while you say that? Uh, don't uh, trouble. Yeah, three, 330, definitely. Yeah, and this is probably the same. Yeah. <laughs> Again, put the moon over my face now. <laughs> Just a YouTuber and in a convertible, event at all, nothing to see. And a fan of the YouTuber. YouTuber. YouTube. Are we going right here? We should, yeah. Let's put that on then and tell the other road users what we're doing. Is this content? I don't really know if it is. So this car then, you're going to get rid of it when? Um, you know what cars I want. There's quite a few on the list. I would like an A12 also. Or a I know who's getting one of them. He's got oh, a very yeah. smug face and needs a slap. He's, I, I heard you went for those ridiculously expensive shields. <laughs> Okay. Not that way, that's the right. That's one way the other way. You actually <laughs> viewers at home, I nearly just went the wrong way down a dual carriageway. That is a video. That was nearly content. What are you doing? Yeah, that was nearly the camera a went, video. Oh yeah. god, I'm so sorry. I just... The camera went all, all over the shop then because oh. I was a little bit panicked. You know I was panicked for just a second? Yeah. Because after that I remembered agreed value insurance. Oh I yeah. I wasn't panicked at all. A head on smashing this though would end up with yeah. the, the other car in here with us. You know how there's complicated controls in this car? Yep. Like, I don't even know how to launch it. No, there's like thrust mode, but that one burns of, out the clutch and we don't uh, want to do that. So one other issue is I don't know how to turn the airbag back on in the passenger seat. So if anyone's been in this car with me, I am sorry, <laughs> but I have no idea how to put the airbag you back on. You probably can't, it's probably broken. So it's an Italian thing. They don't like airbags, I don't okay. know. No, it's, I, I do like, I, do you know what? I trolled my events arrest a little bit in uh, some podcast yeah, that I did with so. BATV recently. Yeah. I got put on the spot, which was the worst car you've had? And I yeah. should have said the 720S because it's clearly you had the minis. You can no. say anything. Well, no, like value for value. <laughs> obviously, a mini is worse than like a supercar. Yeah. But the 720S was clearly the worst car I've had. McLaren is clearly yeah, the worst I was brand I've ever that. I was thinking you didn't even say the 720S. Absolutely crap. Let alone the Hurricane Perth that you had for five and a half seconds. Yeah. Well, I did. I never actually took ownership of that, so we can't count that one. Oh. Yep. Just a YouTuber, nothing to see. <laughs> Foot slipped. <laughs> Are you regretting this yet? Uh, Have you ever seen the plate and that's yeah, that, up and They'll all remember mine, yeah, yeah. That's, yeah. Why do you think I behave any differently when I'm driving? No, you don't, you're worse. I'm behind you. You hear me coming. Is this more yobbish? Roof off with hood on. Great. Uh, do I look like the kind of person to have a hood up? No, you don't have a hood today. No, I'm wearing a. Very civilized attire. Yeah. I didn't realize you'd be crashing the party, stealing my car. This is chaos. I had, um, if you dress like a scruff in these cars, I had it earlier, um, two guys came up to my window and they're getting selfies with me and they assumed that I must have been famous. Yeah. <laughs> they're going to be so disappointed when they realize yeah. it's a really you're bad. Not, you're not a footballer. Rubbish YouTuber. That's, that's really the, the most disappointment you can ever get is driving around Chelsea on a match day just around Fulham Broadway and just before the match and as you drive out of anywhere people kind of run to the car to see who you are yep. and then they walk away looking really disappointed and then they realise you're actually yeah, like, you're a no one you're, you're a famous YouTuber though very famous very famous and successful YouTuber yep Not the worst content on YouTube yes. these motorbikes are just everywhere aren't they although you actually you can see through there which is quite good as a uh, safety feature this is a good review, isn't it? It's a very good review. If you crash it, it'll be a great video. Are we being let in? Many thanks. I'm going left here, yeah? Yep. See, maybe just been dead to us. <laughs> it does, yeah, it does feel a lot more palatable. The SV is just, it's just so raw. Seats, so it's just nice to not have like spine ache. If you had your chance again, 
Would you go for one of these or uh, an SV? With a, like we were, ignoring this depreciation. This has kind of come up between us recently on chat, and yeah. I think you're right. Um, when I went to buy these, I remember seeing the SV. Uh, sorry, the the yeah the SV roasters being like 450. Yeah. And I just thought everyone was going on about the four-wheel steer, and I did a Goodwood driving day, not Goodwood, uh, Millbrook driving day, and I just thought, you know what, I'll get this one. But now I'm looking at them, and there is temptation to actually swap. After trolling your car and how bumpy it is and noisy, I think that's what uh, an event is about. Yeah. So yeah, if, you're, if you're going to suffer the single clutch and all these other weird quirks, you should really do it in the real deal. And I think, although this is a good looking car, I think the SV is one of the best car yeah, looking cars I've ever, the, ever made. Yeah, it's the poster car, the SV. And but, you do have something, so we should talk about your car history. Yeah. You have had Porsches, you're a Porsche guy. Yep. You I've, love Porsches, you've I've had, had so many. Oh, I've had a couple of Turbo S's, Turbo Cab, GTS. I had, yeah, two Porsches this year. Yeah. And um, I'm also a 4x4 person. I like my Range Rover. G I had the old G Wagon, which I, yep. I just got rid of nicely. The diesel one, the, yeah. the new diesel coming out. It's gone. Yeah, so that is what. Why is it just dropped into our gear? It will always do that. That's a Lamborghini that thing. It does it to embarrass you at traffic lights, but it doesn't embarrass us because we enjoy doing that. Yeah. Um, we have done anyway. But yeah, when I heard you getting the new one and I saw what was happening to prices, mine went. Oh! Straight away. We have been joined. Okay. We have been joined oh. by uh, someone who's come to ruin my afternoon. Mind the wheels. Oh, they're silver already, actually. It doesn't really matter if I scrape them, does it? Uh, it still matters, mate. Nah, not to us, mate. Uh, the, the gentleman at Posh Wash will sort me out there. I don't know why I'm like, doing this so gingerly, like it's a, a car that I've never driven before. I've had very many of these. It does have a reversing camera, that's something. Do you see the car in front? You What's miss that? that. Yeah, it's good. Do you know what he's done with that as well, which is quite cool? He's painted the, the, the plastic bits. Well, right, let's, let's yeah. get out of here. Do you want to reclaim your camera? Yeah, let's do that. Anyway, I think... I'm going to put the handbrake on now. I'm going to jump out of this. Many thanks. We're going to go and take a look at that F12. The owner's there, he's probably going to hate us for it. Oh, accident. Was that a crash? I think it was a crash. It was a crash. We had a bump. Crash. We've had a bump. We've had a bump. Have we had a smash? Was there a smash, ladies and gents? Ah, uh, you see? That would have been content. So yeah, very, very cool F12 here. And he's actually painted the uh, plastic bits on there. I don't want to get too close because yeah, he's probably just trying to enjoy his Saturday. Anyway then, I'm going to end this video on some footage of this beautiful car because you've probably had enough of my face and my voice. Thank you so much for watching. Do subscribe and I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye. And if you're still here, let me know. You've watched the video. Go and follow me on Instagram. Leave a comment and I will follow and potentially abuse some of you. So yeah, get in the mix and I'll see you over on Instagram.